Hello everybody, I'm Natalie and welcome to Nat's Hammies. Today, I'm going to be doing a Walmart hamster haul. So I just got back from Walmart and I wanted to share some things you could get from Walmart like that might not necessarily be for hamsters or small animals, but can be used for them. And you might have not think of thought of that. So let's get straight into the video. So this is the bag right here. I also wanted to note that this is my first face video. This is my second video on my channel. And yeah, I thought just wanted the channel to be more personal. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So I'm going to combine both um, Dollar Tree and Walmart because they have some of the same things. So I just didn't look for them at Walmart because I already got them from Dollar Tree. But Dollar Tree and Walmart are very cheap places where you can get things that can be for hamsters. So this is a really good one at Walmart. I found this um container this is just a round glass bowl this can be used for a sand bath and what's cool about it is that the hamster doesn't have to climb in you can actually put it on its side and you can actually bury it in a little bit and they can climb inside this would be best for a dwarf or robo hamster because it is like s on the smaller side but i feel like a small cereal would still be able to fit in here so this is a really good find and it's actually like the perfect shape and size the next thing that i found were um some measuring spoons and cup this can be used for your hamster's diet and um if you want to get a certain amount and just for putting food in you doesn't have to be a certain amount but i wanted to get this because i'm going to make my not necessarily make my own seed mix it's like i already have a seed mix but i'm going to do like a spoonful of seed mix and a spoonful of dried mealworms and i feel like that would have a balanced diet with um that so i don't really necessarily need the big ones but it could come in handy i'm probably going to use like this one and maybe this one but they all came in a pack and i only, it was only a dollar the next thing that i got was oh it's upset <laughs> it's bad organic like applesauce squeezies I haven't, I have, this is my first time getting it, but I know it's organic and there's no added sugars. This would be good just for like something rarely where you just want to give a different like texture food. This is also good for elderly hamsters. I know Victoria, Rachel, she um used one of apple sauces. I don't know if it's this one. And she was, she just held it and the, the hamster was eating it. It was so cute. So I just got these. These are good for a while. And make sure if you're planning on getting like something like this, that there's like no added sugars or something. Cause you don't want it to be super sugary or it's not good for your hamster. I wanted to add that um walmart does have like a hamster or like small animal area they don't have a lot so i wanted to make this video more of things that you would find that is for other uses but you could still use it for them the next things that i got was um healthy bit treats i actually never saw these before these are for like rabbits and chinchillas and any small animal you might be able to find something like this uh but i wanted to get it because it looks like a really cool treat like it looks if I was a hamster, I'd want to eat this. Don't take it the wrong way. But it's like a seed mix and it has like a bunch of seeds in it. Well, no, duh. Oh my God. It's really good. But I got this. I never had these before and oh, I've never had them before. That should be clear, but I'm just talking about I never own these. The next thing that I got was um millet sprays now these are for birds but they're perfectly good for hamsters um i was actually thinking about ordering millets this is making too much noise i don't think it was a millet I, it was like something like that it was sprays but it it, it looked like that but i don't like ordering things because i'm not a patient person when it comes to stuff i like want right then so i just got these these are perfectly fine for hamsters uh, i saw these online I saw these online and uh, I was gonna get them online, but I was looking at the reviews and some said that it like wasn't packaged well. So I just, I just happened to see this and I was like, hey, I'll just get it. And this can be used for just like a treat. You can place them in your cage and your hamster will munch on them. So if you wanna know, it's the KT Natural Spray Millet. Okay, the last thing I wanted to show was I found this 200 quart bin. This could be amazing for um, a bin cage which it's uh the measurements i'm pretty sure it's like 530 square inches of floor space which is above the bare minimum if you're planning on getting a bin cage and this was only about 26 dollars 
uh, it goes like straight up and the length is like perfect if you have a bigger wheel like a Syrian. Um, this is great for a bin cage. So this is a 200 quart, I think it's the sterilizer bin and I really recommend this. Uh, I'm actually planning on making a bin cage tonight. So this will be perfect for that. So this is the last thing I found. This was actually a really good find and it was uh, great going to um, Walmart and Dollar Tree finding this stuff because now I have like a better bin and I have some more treats for my hamster. Okay, so I really hope you enjoyed the video and this gave you um, maybe an open-minded to just when you're looking at any store, maybe look at what it could be used for in hamster use if you're looking for things on a budget because sometimes when you go to pet stores they overcharge things when it could just be used you could use something else that re replicates that exactly i really hope you enjoyed the video and um i'll see you guys next time bye huh.